So this move is definitely more advanced. It's the rear foot elevated split squat into a Romanian deadlift. So I'm gonna break you down through each step and then I'll show you how you can make it easier or how to build up to it. It's primarily gonna target our quads and our hamstrings and our glutes. So we're gonna start off just like we would in any rear foot elevated split squat. We're gonna have our knee on the ground. Now I would normally have a yoga mat or an air X pad under my knee to start. And then you want about a 90 degree angle here on the opposite leg. For this one, my left leg is forward. I want the weight in my right hand. Now from here, I'm gonna pop right up into my starting position. And I'm simply going to go into rear foot elevated split squat. So weight is in my heel. I'm popping up. And now I'm going directly into a single leg RDL. So when I do this, the form is the same as a regular RDL. Okay, we want our hips to be squared and forward. My toe is pointed down, not out to the side. And I'm gonna go down slowly under control the mid shin and then pop up. Except I'm not gonna go to a full range of motion here. I'm just gonna go until my foot returns to the box behind me. And then I'm gonna repeat right through here. So like this. And this is just lighting up my entire left leg. Doesn't take many of these to feel it. And that is how you do the Reefert Elevated Split Squat to a RDL. Now to work up to that, there's a few things you can do. One is you don't have to have the foot elevated, so you can simply go split squat, RDL. You could also just break up the movement, so you just do split squats one day, and then the next day you do purely single leg RDLs. So have fun with that. 